Hey guys, in today's video we're going to be going over one of the most underrated guns in Modern Warfare 2, the Lockwood MK2. It's one of my favorite snipers to use right now. It's super consistent, extremely fast, and a great secondary for when going for clips and things like that. So we're going to be going over the class setup that I use in this video in one second, as well as showing you guys some more clips and we have some great gameplays at the end. So make sure to check those all out and I will see you guys in a few. He hits every shot. This kid is crying right now. Someone cry some more. This is why I run here, by the way. I killed him. All right, fans, so let's go over the Lockwood MK2 that we used in today's video. So just real quick, this is the perk package that I used, the lethal and tactical grenades, as well as the field upgrade for the trophy system. And now we'll jump into the Lockwood MK2 build. Starting off for the Lockwood MK2, you guys are going to use the 25 Buffalo Barrel for the damage range, get movement speed, bullet velocity, and hip fire accuracy out of this one. And then for the tuning on the Buffalo Barrel, guys, you're going to want to use around 0.27 recoil steadiness and then max out the damage range at 0.40. For the optic, guys, we are using the SPX80, the 6.6x scope. And then for the tuning on this scope, guys, we're using 1.84 for the aim down sight speed. And then we kept the close and far eye position in the middle. For the next attachment, we were using the cutoff stock mod for the sprint to fire speed, the movement speed, and the aim down sight speed, of course. Next up, we were using a lever on this build. We were using the Longhorn lever for the rechambering speed so you get faster shots. All right, so this is the last and final attachment for the Lockwood MK2. This is the Lockwood Commando Guard. However, if you guys are feeling like you're getting a ton of flinch, you can always switch back over to the Lockwood Combat Guard. It does slow down your ADS speed a little bit, but the flinch is almost non-existent with this one. So I find myself jumping back and forth between these two, but that's what I would recommend. And then I'll show you the tuning on this one. And then the tuning on this guard, guys, you're going to want to put the sprint to fire speed around 0.19. Any higher than that, it actually takes away from your sprint to fire time. And then everything else I left even. So this would be my full Lockwood MK2 build. I hope you guys enjoy the gameplays that we have for you at the end. And I will see you on the next video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks so much, everybody. Let me crack, let me crack the fingers, bro. Get ready. We got my, uh, we got my LA Thieves set up. Wait, why is this not the... Oh, whatever. Alright, what's the... Oh, dude, the aim and speed on this is great. I'm sticking with this one. If this flinch resistant stuff is great, this is going to be nuts. Now, I want to see a YouTube video every single day for the next week. Yeah, that's the plan. I'm going to try to pop some melatonin, wake up early, stream, uh, get a video done. Shit, you know what it is. like the latest shit right now.
Dude, I literally choked too. I would have just hit a five on times two, at least. What? Get off me, son. Oh, bro. Fire it out. Dude, I'm getting like crazy latency spikes. Dude, please with the fucking hit markers. Did they nerf the MK2? Got him. Got him too. Come here, puss. Come here, puss. I'm so scared of it, What's up, dude? Yo, this lock, this lock was pretty fire. It's a little bit slower than the average one, but this lock one is fire. Yeah, I feel. You got it, baby. Dude, get out of the fucking spot, bro. This kid is crying right now. Like this would be a gas lobby if my teammates weren't afraid to get the point when they have it. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video on Modern Warfare 2. If you guys are looking for some other Modern Warfare 2 content, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and check out these videos over here. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.